thank you for tuning in to another episode of the April Lewis Experience, where I teach you how to clear your mind so you can crush your goal. So today, I'm not doing an interview. I want to share a very personal message with you, personal for you. I want you to relax, and I want you to think about it. When was the last time you truly relaxed? How do you relax? What inspired me to talk about this today was I was on an interview, a radio interview. I actually post the link um, in the chat below. Uh, shout out to Simran Singh. She had me on her Stereo Talk. It's an app. Uh, I actually never heard about it, but the app is called Stereo. So it's similar to Clubhouse where there is no video. It's all audio and you can connect with people all around the world. But we had a very, you know, she called it Join the Conversation. And we were just talking and we were sharing. And Simran is someone that I have been knowing for years. She actually was my life coach back in 2006. Seven, and all these years we stay connected and she has seen me go through all the cycles and phases and all the good things of the April Lewis experience. And one of the things that Simran said, and I call her Simi, Simran is her official name, but I call her my Simi. One of the things that she said during the interview is that she sees me now and she sees me on social media and how I show up on camera and engaging with people and I'm much more relaxed than I've ever been. And it was interesting and I told her, I am relaxed. That feeling that I used to have of constantly having to do something, do it a certain type of way, striving for perfection that doesn't exist, always being busy, may not be producing anything or creating anything, but I was just busy is no longer my story. I rewrote my story on my life. I changed the experiences that I were having each and every day. And I did that because I truly anchored in my purpose. I dedicated my energy, my focus, my time, and my resources to seeing who was I as identified and created by God, and I became her. And in the becoming of her, I had to change some scenes, location, leave a whole career, walk out on entrepreneurship with a leap of faith, leave people, terminate some relationships, change up some family dynamics, all the things, because I needed to relax and be April Lewis. So are you relaxed today? Are you comfortable in the skin that you're in? Are you comfortable with what you're doing every day for your job or in your business? Or do you feel stressed? Are your shoulders right now clenched tight or are you relaxed? Is your abdomen relaxed and you're just breathing? Do you feel like you're right now on this Sunday evening or whenever you're watching this, your mind is already in the next day? Are you already thinking about the things that you need to do? Or are you able to just be present in this moment and be still for a few minutes as I tell you, friend, relax. You don't need to be stressed. You don't need to be worried. You don't need to be fearful. You don't need to be anxious. Now, you may have reasons to be those things because of life and situations, both external and internal. But how we respond to them is what create our reality, which creates the experience that we have. Stress is how you respond to a situation outside of yourself right? So I want to encourage you today when life is happening all throughout the day, ask yourself, am I relaxed? If you look back at the interview I did with Dr. M, who was amazing, she posed a question for you to ask, is this loving to me? Is what I'm doing right now loving to myself? So if you're thinking about tomorrow or stuck in the past, is that loving to you? Are you showing yourself unconditional love, that, that godly, agape love, that whatever you've done, whatever you're going to do, whatever you haven't done, you are still beautifully and wonderfully made and you are still deserving of love? Are you showing that to yourself or do you find it easier to show it to other people more than you give it to yourself? So I want you to relax. I want you to relax in your seat at this moment. I want you to relax in the present moment of your life. I want you to relax and know that you are right where you need to be doing what you are supposed to be doing, even if you feel like you aren't. Because as you relax and you be still and you listen for God's still small voice, you'll get your direction. Your steps will be ordered and you will be able to determine what to do next. So even though you may be in a particular situation, you aren't that situation. This is just where you are. So relax, breathe, listen, and then move forward in a very balanced and harmonious way. There is a lot of things happening in this world today, friend. There are a lot of things going on with you that I will never know. There are things going on with me that you will never know. But in this moment, I am choosing to relax. 
One, because I trust God and I know that all things are going to work together for my good. And two, what good would stress do? That's not the most loving thing that I can do for myself. So on this day, your friend, April Lewis, is giving you permission to just relax. Don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel. I want you to stay connected with me. We will be back next week with a phenomenal interview from a rock star, amazing woman, Tracy Williams. She is actually in Texas right now. So I send peace and love and warmth and virtual hugs and all the things to my Texans. I pray that that situation is getting better. And to everyone that's dealing with cold right now, um, I send you all type of positive vibes and I just know that God is going to work it out. So I welcome all comments. I welcome you to share this with a friend. So have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful morning. Have a wonderful evening. Have a wonderful night wherever you are in the world. And remember, relax. You got this.